Well, police say they can stop criminals before they commit a crime, and they are proving it. New data shows crime rates are way down in some parts of Shawnee. Johnny on Thompson went out to see how officers there are doing this. Johnny on. Well, good afternoon, Mark. Cops say that there is a link between dangerous driving habits and criminals. So they started using a system about three years ago. They called DDAX. It's like a data collection system, and it's one of the first to be used in the country. So officers will sit at spots where they know there are more car crashes and criminal activity. Police say crooks are more likely to drive dangerously, and they think they can stop them before they commit the crimes. In Shawnee, that was in two areas, one in the northeast side of town and another in the southeast corner. Police say new analysis shows that crime rates are way down. In one case, police tell us home burglaries are down 65%. We put our police officers in the locations where crime and crashes happen. Uh, then we ask them to make high visibility traffic stops. We want their red and blue lights flashing in the areas in the neighborhoods where crime and crashes are known to occur. Is it about writing more tickets? No, um, and honestly, I think a lot of us actually write warning tickets. It really is for us, for those of us who work the road. It's just about educating people. And police also tell us that they just ask these officers to look at those areas during their regularly scheduled hours, so it really isn't costing anyone anything extra. Live in the newsroom, Jody on Thompson, 41 Action News.